All right, Dinwiddie and I and the dog, we're out looking for new home sites. That's a good sign. You see that wall out there? That's an old sheep wall for sure. We're getting close to something. See what we can find. All right, this place is pretty cool we just found. I don't know if you can see, but there's a huge cellar hole up here by Dinwiddie. You got all kinds of foundations, you know, like well holes. This concrete over here is just full of tin cans. And I just got my first suspender button. I don't know if someone's hit this, but let's see what we can get. Well, there's a big old clock piece. So I'm starting to think this has been dug before, because there is stuff like this pipe sitting up on here. And we're not finding a lot so far. Look at that cool door piece. Looks like there's a bottle here in the foundation. Doesn't look to be too awfully old. So I got me a key. Oh, where'd it go? Oh, there it is. It's got a lion or something on there. That like an old Ford key, like an old Model T or something. Clean that sucker up. I don't usually clean up keys, but that one's pretty cool. Yeah, it's got a lion on it, and it says Master. So I guess a old padlock key. Well, Dinwiddie got himself an old horseshoe. Well, yeah. it looks small. Can this uh, mystery find? <laughs> yeah, the dog needs us to throw the stick. What's your problem? I got a spoon. Yeah, it's still got a lot of silver plating on it. Nice. So, they left me some stuff. Oh, I think it's got a little fancy up there. Let's see if we can. Yeah, hold on. Yeah, that's really cool. Dinwiddie scored a coin. What you got there, man? Well, I mean, it's not awesome getting a weedy, but at least it helps us date it. So, yeah, I think that looks like 1928, something like that. So not amazing old, but it helps. Oh dang! I dropped it. Oh no! Right there in my hand. <laughs> Man, I think I get a Cones Boss button in almost every episode. <laughs> it's so crazy. I have so many of these. All right, now we're talking. Got some suspender, and I think. I've got a lot of these before, and I think it says security on it. Look at that. Man, I just love getting little relics. All right, let's see what else is out here. All right, I think I got a hot patch here. Look at that second security button. So maybe they're just uh, our button. The second, the second security. Uh, suspender clip so I don't know maybe they threw their pants right here the other one wasn't too far away I think I got a coin yeah another weedy 1924 S oh that's really cool. Yeah, I don't know what it is. No, I think it's a cow tag. Yeah. You getting the... Let me see what that says. Right. If it says Phoenix. Or... Phoenix U Company Moroni. Oh, Moro, New York, I think. I bet oh. that's what it is. Moro, New York. 
Awesome, dude. It's so cool. Never found one of those. So up behind, there's a big old apple tree. And watch this, I'm just walking up. Wait, where is it? That sounds an awful lot like a coin. What do you think? Live dig it? All right. Live dig, here we go. Wow, oh, that sounds good. What do you think, guys? Is that the silver coin we've been looking for? So it's dropped to a 2122. So probably not a silver coin. But it might be an Indian head penny or a weedy. Nope, just a gosh darn bullet. So one thing that's around all this apple tree, which we've been seeing quite a bit of at this site, lots of bear scat. That's full of choke cherry seeds. They're all trying to fatten up for the winter. So they're doing berries and apples and yeah, hopefully uh, we don't bump into him. All right, the last one was just too obvious. It had obviously been hit by the Tectris, but look what we just got. We got foundation, baby. And there's the cellar right there. Crazy. And then up over here, just a little bit, there's some other down building. I should have filmed it, but just over the hill here. Awesome apple tree. Yeah, and this, this is probably an older site than the one we were just digging. So hopefully this one's more like 1890, 1910, something like that. Sorry about the cows, they're pissed. All right, let's get our stuff out and get to work. All right, there's my first target at the site. The new one. Boom. Yeah, we got all day, so it's still early. So we're going to be able to put some time into this one. I'm excited. Dude, I got a cool one. I think that says police on it. That's some sort of a suspender. I think it says police. Hold on. Clean this sucker up. It says police brace. I'm going to have to do some homework on that. That'd be crazy. This is an... Another cop thing I found at an old old slate. I never seen that one before. All right, so I got this weird thing, and I was thinking maybe that was sterling. After looking at it, Dinwiddie and I think it's a ring. We're thinking it used to be attached right here, and then it was, you know, rounded, which probably had a big stone in it. Yeah, I think that might be a piece of sterling. Let me see if I can find a mark on this sucker. Yeah, I think we've decided that's a sterling ring, although we can't find a mark. It's got the weight, rings upright, and plus nothing comes out of the ground looking quite that nice. Man, I was just saying to Dinwiddie down at the last side, it'd be nice to find a sterling ring at one of these sites. Wasn't I saying that? Yeah. It'd be nice to find a gold coin at one of these sites. I'm going to see if it works. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I've been working my way to the foundation. And I just got to the edge. Boom. Suspender piece. Well, we've been digging and digging and digging. Someone's been here too, obviously. But wow, look at that half a little baby uh, airplane there. Got windows. Yeah, that's an old, oh, it's a propeller plane even. Yeah. That's an old toy. Mm-hmm. That's way cool. That's cool. Look at the ornate on that stove piece. I tried to find more of it. It was all gone. That's beautiful. 
<laughs> this is such an interesting clip. <laughs> this clip has got <laughs> a diaper pin through it. Also, I think there's some fancy. Let me clean this sucker up. So it's a V, and then it's got that, I don't know what that is, Florida something. You know, the little French symbol. A G. And look, it's a clip, but it's also a pin. <laughs> Definitely plated. That's fancy. Whatever the heck it is. That's cool. Hey, got me a little sign. We're actually not in Dixon, but G-O-F Zerlo, Dixon, Montana. We're not that far from Dixon. So I wonder if this is who you used to live here or something. That's cool. Man, I think I got an awesome one here. Yeah, that one's killer. Look at that buckle. That's crazy one. Clean that sucker up. Get a good look at it. Cal over here is angry. Doesn't like me getting all the treasure. Look at that buckle. Man, that thing's crazy looking. What do you guys think that was? Like a main belt buckle? Thing is crazy looking. It's definitely brass or something. Awesome. Button with stars on it. it. Says something right here, or there's a picture or something. I just can't make it out. All right, I got a weedy here. Looks like. Cool thing is that'll help us date this one a little. Well, this says 1921. I wonder if that was towards the end of everyone living here. That's my guess. Got me a pretty decent suspender button. It says iron alls. What do you think, guys? Should we live date this one? Sound pretty good. Probably just a shell. Whoa. Dang, that's a big old button. Clean that up. I think I got some shank on there. So it is plain, but that's really an awesome button, especially for around here. Look at that erect shank on there. This thing's in perfect shape. It sounded cruddy because it's only the top piece. Yeah, Union ABC button. Cool, man. Yeah. So, Dinwiddie and I decided this this apple tree is just down from uh, uh, the home site we were just at, and we're on our way home, and uh, we're like, ah, oh, let's go dig there. I don't know if you can see where Gunner is. That brown spot right there, huge bear turd. And then we got like a little spring over here. So that's how smart we are. Right before dark, we're headed to the apple tree that the bear likes to sit under. By the water, where he likes to drink. So, if you're watching this, either someone found my camera, or we did survive. Yeah, there's a close-up for you. There's my shovel. Look at that. Grizzly or black bear? Let's not find out. All right, there's that big tree we were just at. Not much down there. I actually got a pull tab and a washer. <laughs> uh, anyways, awesome day out. Hope you enjoyed it. See you next time. All right, this is what addicts we are. I just ended this episode. We were just at that apple tree, and I'm like, oh, it's over. And the apple tree is right over here, and the pond thing I was down by is right over there. Look at that. I found a cellar hole just right up here on the hill. Doesn't really make any sense, 
there's like a clock in it seat to a tractor so we're gonna have to <laughs> dig for 15 20 minutes it's, it's getting close to dark but we just can't drive home and at least not swing here a little so see what we can get